So, hello everyone. So, today we will tackle about how to use vouchers to pay. So, first we need to log on on the retail management backend or pod settings. Next, we need to set up vouchers. So, in creating a vouchers, we also need to create a vouchers group. So, after creating a voucher group, we need to go for the dishes to set up the dish voucher groups. And then, uh, for the payments, uh, we need to click the vouchers as checkout type and then after that we need to test by logging on to pod post to place an order and to use vouchers to pay for the bill so first we need to log into the pod settings and then under the uh, sales button there's a coupon so, we need to create a coupon. So, just click add. And then, coupon, for example, is a big sale. Big sale voucher. Okay. For example, is 11, 11 voucher. So, the price will be 100 or just 11. And then, click Save. Okay? And then, for example, you have uh, another voucher. For example, is the uh, end of month voucher. So, 1030 voucher. So, the price will be 30. I click Save. And then, we need to go to Coupon Group. So, there's a, a Not Use for a default and a Coupon Group. So, for the Not Use, we'll be adding Promotional Coupon. Or we, what we call Seasonal Coupon. So, we need to choose what is the seasonal coupon for us, for our store. So, for example, the first coupon will be the big sale. And the second is the end of sale voucher. So, click save. And then after that, we need to go to, we need to set up the voucher group per uh, menu. For example, all this knock is under the promotional uh, seasonal voucher. So, just drag it. Click Edit Item, and then for the coupon group, just uh, choose for the seasonal, then click Set. Okay? So, after that, we need to test in the pod settings, and then under the payment. So, under the coupon, so the payment method is none. So, there should, uh, it should be coupon. Also, okay, just click save and then go back again to the pod post. So I have here, so I just click coupon, okay. So you can see, so under these products, you have big sale and end of day. So I'll just big sale voucher, and then you can enter a remark. For example, my remark is the voucher code. So, for example, the voucher code is 1111VV. Okay. So, the $11 uh, will be deducted to the subtotal. And then, you can add cash. For example, the combination of coupon or cash. Okay. So, just click enter to... Uh, enter, enter the exact. Uh, if you want a change, just click 60. And a change will be shown here or here. Okay? 